All right. I guess a good point was made in my channel, or in my stream, rather, that I might as well play regardless. Why not? Let's see. World Baduk always liked me. I could always go a little bit larger on World Baduk, I think. So let's go ahead and see if we can get a pretty good viewing angle here. I think that should do it. Not making any pretense of hiding who I am anymore. Everyone knows my account. So, the admins of World Baduk don't like it. I guess they can just go ahead and delete me. So, let's try and kick off the first game of the... Excuse me. Uh, first game of the Six Dawn series on World Baduk. And that is entirely too fast. I'm sorry, I refuse. I think what I was waiting for was English users actually being able to get back. That is not good either. English users actually being able to get back into uh, Korea 1 before I actually started my series. I mean, it's probably going to end at 6 Dawn, so I began it in Korea 1. It'd be nice to end it in Korea 1. Oh, let's see if we can get ourselves a game, though. Um, 20 minutes? That's a little bit too long, but I'll go ahead and do it, otherwise you're going to refuse and it's going to be disgusting. I'm white! How did I know I was going to be white? Oh, right, I'm always white. That's how I knew I was white. Ha ha ha. I knew that now. Hello, and nice to meet you. He's playing the 3-4 point. No, he's playing 4-4. Four, four. How fascinating. This might be an interesting game after all. Let's go ahead and enlarge my board a bit. Get you guys a bit of a better view. Now, this is a bit strange. He's still not approaching my 3-4 stone. That's, I don't know, a little unusual. 3-4 is more important. I mean, <laughs> uh, those of us who try to... What the heck is that? Those of us who try teaching try to tell you that it's more important. But no, seriously, what is that? I guess I'll just get a two space extension. I have never, s I don't think I've ever seen that before. A large night move? I don't know its function. Um. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hane here, he might hit my stone. Ayatari and fix him in bad shape. I hit his stone. Still in bad shape. But he's over concentrated too, so I don't know what he's doing here. Let's go ahead and uh go up. Threaten to capture. Alright, and now he's going to go ahead and approach me. So right away, thoughts on this game is that this is a large move because this group of his that he made it is not alive. Uh, I'm not going for influ- well, I could go for influence, can't I? But I don't like this. I could go wide. If I attach and go for territory, I don't have a good approach because he'll probably extend to, yeah, all the way across. I don't really want to do that. I'm going to go ahead and pencil him lightly here. Or, well, tightly, I meant to say. <coughs> um, 
interesting idea. I'll go ahead and get territory. Strange idea. Not Chiseki, as far as I'm aware. This lean is, and then he gets weird influence in the center. I never like it because I don't really ever have a clear idea of what to do with just like this little squiggly land of influence that black gets from the uh, Chiseki. Interesting, but not going to kill me. In fact, I want to lean on this stone now. I lean on this stone, I'm attacking both of them at the same time. He disagrees that I'm actually attacking him. How curious. Well, I will extend out then. So I'm still going to separate him. What you gonna do? I think I turn my volume up a little bit. All right, so we're doing this. Which is the good way? I guess I'll lean on him this way. In terms of territory, he's got maybe some of this corner. It's still open to 3-3. Three, three. That's about it. I've got the upper left corner. Pretty solid, but again, that's it. Alright, what are we doing now? I guess he's going to cut me off. It's a little odd. Alright, so I go here, he pushes, I block, no bad idea, I push, or I back, he back, I back, he push, I block, he cuts, that's unfavorable. Alright, so I go here instead, he cuts, I extend, hmm. A little bit unfortunate. Maybe it is the right way to do this. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Because if I play here, uh, he cuts through. Then he can Atari. Hmm. Which one fits me better? I don't know. I might be hallucinating, but I kind of like this. And it looks like one of my viewers has found my stream. Very, very strange opening. Look at um, F3. 
13, and you'll see the uh, bit of odd play by black. Yeah, like I've said, very, very strange opening by black. And he has left the room. Bye-bye, watcher. Go ahead and settle myself here. I have to be a little bit careful of this group over here, but right now it's okay. I mean, it's got the beginnings of shape. This move can be captured immediately, so I'm not terribly worried about my uh, ability to live just yet. Oh dear. Nope, I'm not worried. He throws in, I take, he Ataris me, I connect, he extends, I Atari, he connects, I extend. This group dies. He can't play this way. He still can't play this way. He's trying to, though. Can I do anything here? I do something cool, like throw in, then what does he do? He does something like that. That doesn't seem to work. But I don't want to be surrounded right now. So let's simply go ahead and hmm. Not sure what I simply want to go ahead and do. I don't want to be surrounded, so let's not be surrounded. Not being surrounded sounds like a great idea. My small knight can't be cut directly, so that's a plus. Now, this can no longer be cut now than it could a moment ago. So, forget this for the moment. It's a fascinating invitation to cut through. Mm -hmm. 
I really wonder about something. If I go here, he's got to connect. I get to connect. But after that, then what? That top group has my attention. Complete and undivided. And the middle one, to be truthfully. To be truthfully honest here. Because this is still not quite alive. That I don't care about. So I won't care about it. Simple enough. I don't want to care about it, so I won't. Instead, I'll threaten to surround him here, and I'll threaten to surround him there. <sighs> he says I should have cared about it. I still say I should not have. Who is more right? I, mean, I still have my eye here. And I think this little forcing move right here does all sorts of really, really awful things. This group... Oh, if only I could get that in Sente without having to connect. I go here, he goes there... Do 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 doesn't do anything. Do 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 do. That might do some no, because that's gonna be Sente, and then he'll have that. I don't think I can kill him. But let's see how we defend this group, because this group needs to get out, and this group needs to get out, because I have I am not above trying to kill him. Um, I don't mind. I don't mind again. If he connects, I'm capping. He's not going to connect. He's going to go to Ko? Why are you going to Ko? Where is your threat? My corner? That is a brave, brave Ko. I'll let this group connect in order to kill these stones, I think. We'll see what he's got in mind. This could be interesting. I did not anticipate this co at all. But truthfully, I probably should have. Because one thing he doesn't want me to do, I suppose, is uh, go ahead and... Um, one second. Threat, 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 threat. Where's a good threat? Not a bad threat. There's a lot of bad threats that I could play. Really ugly, disgusting, and vulgar threats. But I want a good threat. That's the kind that I like. Um, I could go here, but I think that might let him live. I could go here. This is more interesting. And then he ignores me. And then I go here. 
that enough for a kill? I think that might be enough for a kill. Because if I any move that I play against him is gonna he's gonna ignore it. I've come to realize that. I go here, he goes there, and I go there, and then I surround it. That seems cool. So why is this not a threat? I vote that's a threat. At the very least, it's going to make me very, very strong to surround him. And if it's making me very, very strong to surround him when he's got no territory, I think that's acceptable. Okay, he admits that's a threat. I was convinced that he's going to ignore it, too. They... <clears throat> excuse me. They always do. They're like, you know what? I've been studying life and death for you know, however long they've been playing. They can live in any situation. So they really underestimate co-threats. If it's not just straight up one move to kill for a follow-up. They really underestimate those co-threats. I imagine his threats should be in the bottom right-hand corner. Or, or not bottom right-hand, the uh, right-hand side. Go against my group. Because I've got two small knights there trying to attack him. That's not the strongest shape in the world. I mean, they're prone to cuts on all sides. What he has to balance, though, is the same thing. If he plays another move against my right group, it has to be to kill. Because my taking will kill him. So he's kind of in the same position that I was with my threat. I wish I could customize this aspect ratio and just move this in closer onto the board. This looks widescreen to me, doesn't it? Does this look widescreen to you? 786 by... I don't know. This looks like a widescreen ratio to me. Anyway, I have six people currently watching this game. Hello to all of you. Normally, I, yeah, normally I take um, pains to hide my chat because, as I said many times before, I have absolutely no idea what World Baduk's policy is regarding what I'm doing. So I kind of didn't want anyone to know who I was. But I flash my name way too many times. If I'm going to get in trouble, I'm going to get in trouble for it if it's you know against their policy to do this kind of thing. Though so <laughs> I doubt they actually have one. I'd be surprised if this has ever come up before. He's certainly thinking about his threat. I should be thinking too. My next threat that I got lined up is a simple cut. I mean, that's a nice, obvious one. Takes away a 9.2. I like it for that reason, too. And then I can think about following up with an extension, because I can probe here if he ignores. Connect. Connect up to this stone. With this eye gone... Depends on what the threat is. It depends on what this threat is, because I can make an eye by capturing this stone. Didn't see that one coming. Doot. 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 
Hmm. And then I have one, two, three. We share one. He'll have one. Two, three. Hum de dum de dum. If I take right now, what happens? He takes. I don't see any reason to take. Wait, I'm insane. If I... No, I'm not insane. I am insane. If I take, he takes, I Atari, aren't we back into co? So if I connect, what is he going to do? He's going to extend. Right. And then I Atari. And then he's going to connect. And I'm going to connect. And then he's going to connect. And I Tay, I Atari, he connects one, two, three, four, five local liberties against my one, two, three, four, maybe? We share the middle one. Or the oh, is this weird or not? Uh, doot, doot, doot. I can't see a way to kill him after that, I don't think. Because I'd have to fill in... I'd have to get rid of these two. I'm thinking Seki, if I do that. Alright, uh, conversely, I go ahead and take. He takes Ayatari. And then we're back into Ko. No, I take. He Atari. He threatens to kill. I connect. Then he takes. Then I go here. Forget it. If you want a Ko, I'll give you a Ko. Very complicated, though. Now we're back to Co. Technically, we're not back to Co. I can kill these stones right now if I want to. Because I go... He no, I can't. Sorry, hallucination. My bad. Now we're up to seven viewers. Hello to the new arrivals. This is the first game in my Six Dawn series on World Baduk, and as you can see, as I predicted, simplicity begins to go right out the window. I mean, there is not a lot that's very simple about this game. Thank you for my next threat. I wasn't able to play this. Now I am. Wait, if he played that, he's prepared to sacrifice it, isn't he? Mmm, that's why he did it. Do I have a local threat? If I connect right now, he connects. I threaten... No. I go here? That doesn't really matter where. He takes, I cut, these stones are dead. That seems like a good exchange. So he just fed me a threat. Okay, mm we're still in the middle of a code then. This is a huge co too. We're essentially deciding the entire game by this exchange. Because this is huge. Especially if I win this co, this group over here on the left is still unsettled. So I can still cap it even after this group's immortal, I can attack. 
So we're essentially fighting a co over the status of a little more than a fourth of the board, I'd say. All of this is like one giant question mark right now. But this uh, little corner of the board is a giant question mark too, so it doesn't seem like a very affordable co for him, and he really needs to start counterattacking my group here if he wants this to go well for him. That's what I asked myself. Do I respond? I take right now. These stones are dead. He connects, though. I take. This is dead. He pushes through. I extend. Gives me an eye. Then what does he do? He extends again. Okay. I go back and take. These are dead. But then he can attack me. I don't think I want him to attack me. Oops. Okay, Jess. I connect instead. How many liberties, or not liberties, how many threats does that give him? Mm, a lot. But if I extend, how many threats do I take against him? Ooh, this is such... I don't know. I could end it right now. Taking ten stones for my stuff my stealth myself is respectable it is respectable that is a win in my book but i'd be giving up 12 points 13 14 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, six, seven. Mm. It's a little bit of a victory, but I guess it is a victory. That I refuse to take for myself. La 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 la. I want this group unsettled. I'm sorry. This might be me being greedy, but I want the group unsettled. I've got more threats against this group. I'm not done attacking it yet. This one isn't going to settle that easily. If he wants to win this co, he's got to fight this group or sacrifice it. I'm not letting him get away with just doing this. I'll probably die because of it, just you watch. But uh, that's what I want to do. Because he ignores me now, I'm going to poke. He has no choice but to connect it, and then I'm going to connect up. And then this group's surrounded and dead. Simple as that. He can't kill my corner. He won't be able to kill this group. Someone's not listening to my stream. It's surrounded now. There's no escaping. So I'm not going to push him from this side. I'm not going to play K t or not K10 on this board. J10, Tengen, and allow him to maybe push and get something weird here. I'm just going to go ahead and make a little iron pillar to protect this cut point. Make sure this never goes anywhere. Because one uh, very very powerful move that he had was this clamp. That's gone now. This is just surrounded. There's a push and a cut here. But I've got an eye, and I've got liberty, so I'm okay. I don't care. I'll just go back and make sure that this isn't alive, and that'll be dead. So he's got to kill to live right now. He's got to cut through or kill something in order to try to live with that group. And he can't kill my corner, because even if he even defends right now, I'm going to respond. If he defends this stone, I'll make sure that I have 100% living there. No Aji, nothing crazy with B15 working for forcing moves later on, or the Hane for an eye here, whatever else. 
I will go ahead and defend myself. Even though I'm fairly certain I can live without it, just to make sure that there's no algae there, I'd go ahead and defend. Right now, the only thing that he can do is look at these three stones, which I could highlight them, and try and cut. But how is he going to cut? If he attaches, I'm going to bamboo. No, if he attaches, I'm going to back off. There's no more cut there. If he tries to cut here... Again, no cut there. I don't think he's got any Aji. I think he's just lost the game. I think this is game over. But I could be wrong. I might simply be seeing what I want to see. That always happens in your game. Especially when uh, you have the prospect of killing a fairly large one. Then you definitely tend to see whatever you want. Interestingly enough, the characters representing us are okay. Neither of them are crying, which is unusual. I think that uh, the status of the characters here at the top are uh, dependent upon what the score estimator says is going on in the game. Who's ahead? So, I don't know. Alright, he's going to go ahead and do that. That's fine. Um, if he goes... there's nothing back there. This corner's alive as is, right? He goes here, I can go here, we're fine. Uh, he goes here, there's nothing there. So we're okay. Um, instead, what are we going to do? Hmm. Uh, no, 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 what are we going to do? Well, he's starting to get an area here, and he can get territory. I don't care. Well, I kind of do care. It's a lie. I kind of care a lot. But I don't want him getting a moyo, and I can build off in the middle, because I've got this little line of stones. So I'm thinking... Reassess this situation real quick, make sure there's nothing weird going on that I'm not seeing. And... I guess I'll... Just go ahead and split. I'll play nice and calm. Just make sure he can't get any area that's too large, and that'll be that. Now, if this shape was fourth line, I'd be worried. I'd have my 3-3 three, three open to invasion. I'd have potential uh, problem with the throw-in. But since it's third line, I'm not terribly concerned about that, unless there's a sequence up here that I'm forgetting. Okay, he's gonna cut. Okay. Cut, 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 cut. I'm gonna defend, because this is a lot of cut points. I want to make sure this group's nice and strong and it's got liberties and stuff like that. And then if I get to play here, empty triangle, disgusting, I know. But then I'll have two eyes for this group. I am not going to have two eyes for this group, but I am all, uh, uh, not that many liberties either. Alright, what do we do? If he cuts through, I can Atari indefinitely. This is fine. This is not. This is what he's after. So... Let's get out of here. Save ourselves. Run away! Okay. He still wants us dead. Understandable. But we can make an eye here now. Mm. Sorry. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put some pressure on this group. Make sure he can't separate us and kill off my newly created stone. Now that'd be kind of crazy. Oh, look, Black's crying now. That's good. I 
Is it because of the score estimator? Uh, it does say I'm ahead by about 100 points. I guess that would cause someone to cry. And you will notice that the score estimator does err on the side of caution. It just won't grant the territory. If it's uncertain, it just will not mark it as territory. Which is interesting, I think. I've said in many... I think I've said in many anyway. I've not saved so many games that I've played that I forget what I've said in what. But uh, I've said before, somewhere, that uh, I think it's a lot uh, interesting of the score estimator rather than KJS. KJS errors all the time. If you play on KGS, you know how bad the score estimator there is. But things to think about. Right now, I'm pretty certain that these three stones are okay. I mean, it looks really, really weak. But cutting through here, I can Atari, and it goes nowhere. And I don't... so this doesn't work. This... I defend. He cuts again, doesn't matter. He Hanes, I cut. He connects. I can Atari it again, doesn't matter. Alright, he decided to resign. Uh, there is game one of my Six Down series. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I have to say that was a fairly nice way to kick off the series. It makes me confident that maybe, just maybe, I have a chance of being able to actually show you guys seven down, so maybe I'll be able to go ahead and uh, have a seven down series on World Baduck. You never know. But that's all I intend to play for tonight. Hope you enjoyed it, and I shall see you next time.